Joining us for WMBD News at 10, I'm Rebecca Brumfield. When you live a busy life, it's easy to stop at the gas station and pay for your gas at the pump. But after recent issues of local gas stations in the area, Delon Dillard has information on how you can keep your personal information safe. So, paying at the pump is pretty convenient and it's time saving, right? You just have to swipe your card, pump your gas, and you're on your way. But there's a couple of things you might want to be aware of before you insert your card. Paying at the pump is as easy as one, two, three. So, do you prefer swiping your card or paying cash? I prefer to swipe my card, saving you a trip going inside. When I'm rushing, I pay at pump with my card. Um, because sometimes you don't like to wait in line. You might be saving time now, but a headache could be waiting on you down the line. Just last week, skimmers were found at gas stations in Morton. A number of drivers' credit card information was stolen. I do recommend having cash on you if possible because uh, you definitely don't want to be scammed. So there are a number of ways that you can spot a credit card skimmer outside of the pump, but it's what you don't see inside the pump that you might just want to be aware of. In last week's sting of skimmers, Morton Police said you wouldn't have known your information was even being stolen. So before you pump, what can you do? If something doesn't look right on the machine that you're using, you know, if there's something loose that looks like it's tampered with, then we would certainly caution you to use another method. Checking the seal on the pump is an easy way to see if the machine has been tampered with along with the receipt printer and the keyboard. And now CEFQ already has measures in place. As a result of this particular incident, then we have strengthened parameters specific to that and um, have continued to monitor activity on the accounts. So a couple of things. Always be sure to monitor your account for any fraudulent activity. And if you see anything fraudulent on your account, make sure you contact your bank immediately. In Peoria, I'm Delon Dillard. Back to you.